are because everything you guys have done is the exact opposite of what was prompted or told to me or written down. Okay? I'm trying not to trigger your figure. It's not frustration. It's like you call a user ID. Your prompt says it's been accessed from a different account. It blocks me out with a question that I can't answer that I couldn't have possibly come up with. Using a user, you, are, you, are you telling me you issued two usernames to are you the same username to different people? Well, why did your prompt say that it was the same username? It's just a glitch. Look, you better start off with you better start off all over again. Let's start off with I want you to reset this username. I want you to get this straightened out now. I haven't got time to do it. Bank of America all day. Good idea. Good idea. Where are you anyway? Huh? Get your boss. problem. You guys got to explain to me what the hell you're doing down there. I'm not. I'm only making this call because you guys don't reply to emails to online banking. <laughs> because you guys don't reply to emails about online banking. <laughs> or I wouldn't be wasting my time with this. So you got you got you got two people using the same user account. You got two accounts associated with the same username. That's what your uh, your online banking said. And then it asked me a question that can't be answered, which I didn't set. 
I didn't set any security questions. I think security questions are stupid and I don't use them. I got a password for the account which won't work because it asked me a security question that can't be answered which I didn't set and it also told me that there's another uh, account associated with the same username which is like uh, I've never even heard of that before but this is Bank of America so you can explain it to me. Yeah, well, if I had a security question, it wouldn't be the best man at my wedding because I've never been married, you know? So, come on. You understand that somebody else set the security question and I didn't, and somebody else set up a user account, and somebody else's computer is recognized, and which started this whole thing? And the reason I'm calling is because you guys don't reply to emails about these issues with online banking. And then you said I was paperless and, it's, and I got a statement anyway that had to be passed along to me after I thought it was paperless. And then your representative told me that, uh, well, paperless means you don't get a statement. So that's why you guys sent out a statement. So I don't, I'm not sure where to start with all the screw-ups. I tried to put all this into an email, but you guys didn't reply to that either. So here we are. <laughs> well, apologies, apologies don't are worthless to me. I want to get through this call. I want you guys to fix it. Period. Don't need any courtesy. Want to get it fixed. What? Well, if there's another user, associ username associated with account, and I got a, I got a security question that hasn't been that I never came up with, then it sounds like the accounts have kind of been hijacked as far as personal information. So it doesn't really matter what you ask me, does it? Because <laughs> somebody else has already been in the account and changed all this shit. Look, I don't care. I, I, there's this and there's that. There's paperless and there's not paperless. You see what I mean? You see what I mean? There's paperless and there's not paperless. Three eighteen fifty six. you're talking about better repeat that make it 